Hey guys, so today I thought I would talk about eight exfoliating toners better than the Biologic Recharge P50 toner, which I reviewed a few weeks ago. And this has a lot of negatives going for it. A little bit of positives, but mostly irritating factors with this one. So I thought I would do a little video to give you, if you're using this or thought about using this one, some good alternatives, which are better for your skin, fragrance-free, free from denatured alcohol, and also effective with some good ingredients in it. So, and most of these are also much more affordable. Okay, so my first alternative is the Crave Beauty Kayla Lula. Kayla Yuya. Kayla Lula. <laughs> Kayla Lula toner, which is a nice toner, well pH'd, very gentle yet effective for your skin, does a great job removing dead skin cells and things like that. All the meanwhile, not leaving your skin feeling irritated, red, dry, or flaky. So this is a one, good one and also pretty affordable. Another good alternative is the uh, Murad Replenishing uh, Multi-Acid Resurfacing Peel. I'm on my second bottle of this one, so you can see the two layers of this one. This one's a really nice toner, pretty strong. So if you're new to exfoliants, might not be the first one I'd recommend. I'd probably recommend the Crave Beauty one, but this one contains some really good ingredients and sometimes it's on sale at certain places, so it's worth checking out. But this is also a good alternative, contains a lot of different acids. Similar to the, the P50, contains a lot of different exfoliants, alpha hydroxy, beta hydroxy, PHAs, and the Murad also has that. Uh, another good one is the Youth to the People Kombucha 11% AHA Exfoliating Toner. This one uh, contains specifically alpha hydroxy acids in it, uh, as well as kombucha, some good antioxidants for skin. A uh, little bit more expensive than, per se, the Crave Beauty, but very effective, very good for skin, does a nice job without irritating skin like the P50 did for me. Okay, this is a newer one I've been testing out, and that is the uh, PSA Skin, what do they call it, the heroin? 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 Like the drug? Heroin. How do you say that? Heroin? 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 Heroin. Toner, which is a really nice toner, good pH, no fragrance, no drying alcohols in your skin. And personally, it takes me quite a while to go through an exfoliating toner, so I like the little bottle a little bit better because it takes me a long time because I typically use them maybe a couple times a week so typically in place of another exfoliant so it takes me a while to go through them and somehow I find ones I like and then I have to test something else so anyway that's also a nice one that is much better for your skin than the P50. Another good one is the Paula's Choice 2% BHA Skin Perfecting Liquid Exfoliant. Paula's Choice Exfoliants, in general, they do a great job with their exfoliants. You really can't go wrong with any of them, but this one is a nice one. I, I personally prefer some of the serum textured ones, but if you like a toner texture, one that you can put on a cotton pad, this one's a good one. And this is the new updated packaging. They just changed it a bit, so... And another good one, this brand also does an amazing job with their exfoliants, is the Casarex Alpha Hydroxy Beta Hydroxy Clarifying Treatment Toner. This one's a great one. They're, uh, they make some great toners, especially for exfoliating. And if price is an issue, Casarex, this bottle is huge. This will take me forever to finish. So I think the last one took me like six months or a year. So certainly worth checking out. Super affordable, proper pH, and great for sensitive skin. And another one, if you have very, very sensitive skin, this is the one I'd recommend, and that is the Inky List PHA Toner. Uh, not a super exciting long ingredient list, but a short, effective ingredient list, and polyhydroxy acids are great for sensitive skin because they're a little bit more gentle. They don't go as deep down into the skin to exfoliate, and very nice for sensitive skin. So also well-packaged, no denatured alcohol, no fragrance, and pretty affordable as well. And the last one is one more brand where you can't go wrong with their exfoliants, and that is Geek and Gorgeous. I love this brand. Their exfoliants are great. This is their Calm Down 4% PHA toner, but they also have their uh, Smooth Out toner, which is great. They do a great job with their exfoliants, and I love the fact that 
You can get a little smaller sample size or you can get the big size as well. But I just like to test them before I pick up the full size. So this one's their uh, calm down toner, but they do a great job with all of their toners. I've tried all of them. They do an amazing job. Affordable. You can't go wrong with anything from that brand. So anyway, these are my favorite alternatives to the P50. And I'm interested in hearing from you guys if you have a favorite alternative to it that you find your skin loves. So uh, definitely leave a comment. Love hearing from you guys. And stay tuned for more tomorrow. Thank you so much. Yeah, I can't go wrong with any of these. There's, these are all amazing options. So, And Lincoln, do you approve of them? I don't know what the Lincolnometer thinks, but there we go. Okay, thank you guys so much.